What's going on, my dude? That's how I got What's good? Today we are back and we are watching Monster. Hold on. We're watching Goosebumps. Oh my goodness. Y'all haven't filmed a video in so long. I know that y'all not gonna know because I've had videos uploaded still, but just know that it has been at least two and a half months since I filmed a video. So I feel kind of rusty. But shout out to everybody that's currently watching the premiere. How you doing? Hey, looking, how you smelling? I hope you're doing, looking, and smelling amazing. If you're wondering how I am doing, I'm doing okay. Obviously not that great since I'm messing up my intro. I'm looking, I ain't gonna hold you. I'm looking kind of ugly right now. I don't even feel that hot. But I am currently smelling good at least. I'm wearing Armage, what was this called? Beach Hut? Yes, Beach Hut. It's more of a summertime fragrance. By the time this video comes out, we're kind of leaving summer and going more into fall. But regardless, we in the office today, so it's still a good little office scent. Y'all want to get y'all nose on it, go check it out. By the way, some of y'all think that I got sponsored by like cologne and, and perfume companies and whatnot. I'm not sponsored. Like all of the stuff that I show you guys that I smell like, I purchased these myself, just so you know. Nobody is sponsoring this portion of the video. But anyways, if you are in the chat, I really do appreciate you guys being here. If you haven't been told this, you matter, and I love you. I also hope that you guys are drinking your water and stay hydrated. We're, going, we're not gonna do too much talking for this intro because I cannot talk already. Let's just get straight into Goosebumps. Yo, I actually really love R.L. Stein. I think that that dude is a genius. And maybe that's only because I have a bias because I grew up watching Goosebumps. Did y'all grow up watching Goosebumps? Let me know. But that was like my favorite time of school when they would pull out, when they would roll the TV out. Like when a substitute teacher came, it was always like either Goosebumps or Bill Nye and the Science Guy. Never failed. See, already the, the movie already has a really good score to it. I love it. Yo, Schoolastic? I used to feel so sad as a little children, you know, being poor when the book fair would go on. <laughs> Oh man, like if only I just was able to get $25 to buy some books, if only. $25 went a long way back then. $25 probably don't do nothing now. Mom, are you positive that there weren't any other places looking for vice principals? Mm, like where? Detroit. Detroit? Who wants to move to Detroit by choice? No, no disrespect to my Detroit viewers, but y'all gotta feel me, right? I don't know, I'm from Cali, so I there's no other place better than Cali to me. Even though I love Texas, but Cali's gonna always be home. Wait, so I know that his mom got a new job as a principal or whatever, but where's his dad at? Legally, I can't live on my own until I'm 18. You could if you get emancipated though, but I don't know if that's something you want to do. Look at this kitchen. It's bigger than our apartment. We don't cook. Well, look at- <laughs> Well, somebody's gonna do something in there because that's a pretty nice kitchen. Bye. Oh, what the hell? They already got a jump scare in this movie? Hey. <laughs> Oh, so that's why she said that it's so quiet and peaceful because she's from New York. That makes sense. Oh, it's just a beautiful boy. And thank God, because you were such an ugly baby. Oh, oh, I wouldn't let her talk to me like that. Ain't no way. I was a what? Handsome and then back to ugly. No. The <laughs> she really came in here shooting. Plant. This is from my new signature men's line. Ooh. She want to talk about ugly. If she pulled out that hat, no way you're talking to me. No way. You wouldn't even see dogs wearing that hat. Nice to meet you. How long was the drive from New York? Man, you are lucky she wants to talk to you with that dumb hat. <laughs> For real. It's actually a gift from my aunt. It's also a gift for me and everyone who gets to see you wearing it. Oh, she got jokes. I like that. Good talk. Oh, snap, it's my boy, Jack Black. Love him, man. Anything with Jack Black in it, I'm going to watch. Do you see the fence? Yes. Stay on your side of it. Dang. All right. We won't have a problem. I'm sorry, but trying to close a curtain aggressively doesn't look as tough as you might think it does. You were better off slamming a window or something because, you know, doing this, like this motion in itself isn't tough, you know? Like, I don't look hard doing this. Like, I don't even, like, I look like I'm trying to play the cymbals. Like, ding, ding. How are you doing? Hopefully a change of scenery will help. Okay, so then she's not doing that well, basically. Yeah. Oh, don't tell me his daddy is dead. Oh, no. Oh. That's, oh, that's not perfect. Oh. Dang, I'm really curious on what happened to his dad, though. Like, was it like a car accident or I don't know. Did he die at work and his sleep? Whoa, 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 whoa. What, what do you think you're doing? I'm going to work. Gonna do some education. Oh. In the street. She, what? Cool, mom. I <laughs> Yo, she said I'm gonna do some 
<laughs> Administrator. Moms is wildin'. How would y'all feel if y'all parents worked at your school? Has your parents worked for your school? Like, let me know what your experience was like. But if for those that cannot relate, let me know how you would feel. Would you be embarrassed or would you be proud or how would you how would you feel about that? 60 seconds start now. 60, 59, 58, 57, 56, 55. Well, I guess a good thing is he doesn't have to wait for his mom after school. Since he's already on campus, he can just go find her. For all those kids, you know, waiting after school for your parents, they'd be late as hell sometimes. You never know when they gonna come. I remember one time when I was a little children, I, it really felt like my parents forgot about me, but they were just stuck in traffic. But I was at, I was behind the gate like I was in prison. Like my mommy is gonna come, I know it. I know it, she didn't forget, she didn't forget. Hi Taylor. Hi Chump. My real name is Champ. You know, but she's never talked to me before, so we're making progress. Bro, if you don't tell this big headed girl what your actual name is, don't let her call you a name that's not yours. I am so happy to introduce you to our new vice principal, Miss Cooper. Um, y'all already know what I'm about to say, huh? Just for the record, I look just like him with this hat off. Y'all know. Oh, we can see who really wants to talk to her. We can't stop twerking about it. You're, wait, what, mama? Twerking? Are you taking anyone to the dance? Okay. Gonna... The fact that they added twerking to a Goosebumps movie is wild to me right now. Hey, we should go together. Not like together, together, dance together. And... Although that could work. You know, Bro, I am not dan- Chum, I'm not dancing with you. No, school just started and they already have a dance. They must go to a really fun school, I guess. Their butt facing their partner, you will be sent home immediately. <laughs> Yo, that's how we danced at my school. That That's how we dance. I'm not gonna hold you. I wanna know, at y'all school dances, was you guys allowed to- do a little bumping and grinding, or did y'all have to have like six feet apart? Let me know. At my dances, we was doing full on lap dances. No, no, I just, I no, observed. I'm, I'm homeschool. Oh, by your dad? I would have been like, I could tell by the way that you talk. Yeah, you give off homeschool energy. I would have to just feed her the, the disrespect she keep giving me. So is there anything like fun to do around here, aside from scaring your neighbors? Okay, there is one thing that I like to do. Obviously, sneak away from your daddy. That's clear. Bro, don't follow that girl, she's a stranger. Don't worry, it'll be fun. Anytime somebody says, don't worry, you should 100% worry, and you're gonna get in trouble. Nine times out of 10. This way. I'm not walking into no woods with a girl I just met. That's just not gonna happen. <laughs> I don't trust none of y'all like that. No. Hannah? Wait a minute, was he the guy that played in um, 13 Reasons? Is that him, or is it somebody else? What in the world? Now, there's no way Hannah built that. Well, they built it years ago, but then they ran out of money. Now it just sits here. They ran out of money, but the electricity is still on over there? What? Oh, I hate the suburbs. <sighs> Bro, there's no way that it's summer and you got on a sweater and jeans. Both of you guys are dressed like it's wintertime. You're not gonna fall. I wasn't planning on it. Yeah, no, I would not climb all the way up to the top like that. This, it just wouldn't happen. So, why'd you move to Madison? I'd be like, who are you, the FBI? And I said, can we please move to Madison, Delaware? <laughs> That'd be my dream. Are you always this sarcastic? I mean, he gotta be, because you just as sarcastic, so he's just feeding you the energy you've given him. It's just been me and my mom since my dad died last year, so, yeah. Yeah, his dad did die, that's what I thought. Well, I never knew my mom, and we're always moving from one town to the next. What's your dad, a felon? Why are you always moving? What? Thanks for tonight. That was the least terrible time I've had here. Oh, Zach, that's so sweet. He's only been there for a day, so is it really that sweet? He ain't had time for any other experiences. Hannah, what are you doing out here? I'm so sorry. Why is he always whispering? Yeah, when will fathers understand that? Just because you tell a big-headed boy to stay away, <laughs> that's the farthest thing that happens. They actually end up closer. Happens every time, so I don't know what's the point of saying it. Oh, wait, is he abusing Hannah? Not Jack. Not Jack. I refuse to believe that. Oh! 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 Is this a murder mystery in a children's movie? RL, you might have done done something. Hold on. Man, here he come. Put on his cape. Here I come to save the day. Head out. What are you talking about? To get out of here or the last screen you'll ever hear would be a robot. No, wait, wait, wait. Well, Mr. Tough Guy, what's your plans now? 
Mom. Ain't no way he went inside to go tell his mommy. Oh my goodness. Hannah's in trouble. Oh, who's Hannah? Why is his mama looking like that? <laughs> she said, oh, you got a little girlfriend, huh? <laughs> You're doing a great job. You're really? Sorry, you too. Fantastic. We got a call about a possible tense. Not the words of affirmation for the new training cop. Okay. Yes, Hannah's my daughter, and she's been staying with me for a while while her mother sorted a few things out with her new husband. Oh yeah. See, once you start talking about that personal stuff, everybody starts backing off. Like, all right, I don't even want to get in between because everybody always has a story. Surround sound. I didn't know being an audiophile was a crime. A what a file? Oh shoot! Yo, the jokes in this movie, Chef's Kiss, baby. Thank you so much for stopping by and bringing your delightful son and the police. Not the police. Well, hey, no. oh, hold on, me. No, no, just look upstairs. Should I tase him? No. I'll tase him. I like. I love this officer. She is so funny. <laughs> Police report. Three years. Yep, it's close. It's actually, it's a written warning. Hold on. Hold oh my, three years to a written warning? Get this officer off duty, please. She is a hazard to the community. I feel like we should recommend a good treatment center for your son. Yeah, that kid's on drugs. That <laughs> so we went out to sushi on Wednesday, and then I haven't heard from him since, you know? Which is a bummer, because I really liked him. Well, that means that he didn't like you as much. That's for sure. It says stop dating losers and never go on a plane. Well, obviously you're not gonna stop dating losers, so you might as well not complain anymore. The more likely scenario, he lost his phone in like a fire. What? You got if you gotta make up excuses, ma'am, let it go. Let him go. <laughs> he already let you go, apparently. But you know what? I'm just gonna call him. Now I'm worried he's dead. Oh my gosh. The girl, leave him alone. He's not thinking about you like how you are. <sighs> this man got on a full suit. Where is he going? Oh, is it, is it the dance tonight? Come here, get down. Dude, no, this what? is a new suit, all right? Get off. That man said, this is that new Steve Harvey collection. Get off of me. Oh, there is one girl. Oh, my man. Why did he say it like that? <laughs> Does she have a friend? No, I'm serious. He's serious too. He want to know. Does she got a friend? He trying to see, is this a two man or what? Okay, okay. Yo, that kid's parents has money. He said his dry king, his dry cleaning. Oh my goodness. Oh, stay in school. Stay in school. Okay, just so we're clear. Okay, if I sense any danger, I will run the other way. That's what I thought. That because I, I figured that's the only thing he would say is I'm gonna run. Bro, they got a lot of jump scares in this movie. That almost got me. And that's not going to change. I'll just be the lookout. You know, in here. No, no. But that man got scared standing outside. He's born with the gift of fear. <laughs> Yo, walking into spider webs, top five most annoyingest things ever, bro. I swear to you, I can't stand when I run into a spider web because half the time I can't ever find where it's at on my big ass face. The ghost next door? Night of the Living Dummy? Oh, these are all R.L. Stein. What? These are all R.L. Stein books. My grandma lives in Pasadena, and I stopped visiting after reading this book. Okay. You know what kind of impact <laughs> that has to have on a kid, where he doesn't even want to go to Pasadena anymore because he correlates it with this book? Goosebumps was really like horror for children. Goosebumps and Are You Afraid of the Dark? Those two is what introduced me to like horror type stuff as a little children. Zach. Hey. Hello. Why did that man fall? Like that? Yes, okay. Yeah, wait, wait, one, one second. Hi. Hi. Look at my boy. He ain't scared of girls though, huh? <laughs> he said, hold on, let me work Let me work my magic real quick. I really don't care what she looks like. Did you unlock a book? Desperation is crazy. My boy, stand up. Stand up. <gasps> no! Oh, so her daddy, her daddy is all Railstein. That's why those books look like that because they're the original books. Oh, ho, ho. So every time he opens a book, it's gonna unleash whatever monster or, or theme is in there. Mm. Nobody make a sound. Of course, he makes a sound. Oh boy, it's all over with. At least you already wearing your suit so they can bury you with no issue, bro. 
I want to know how do these neighbors not hear that loud crashing? Like he literally busted through a wall. I'm pretty sure the neighbors down the street should be able to hear that. Oh, I can't explain. I have to go. Wait, wait, come on. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, you need to get your weight up. I'm going after Hannah. There he go again, putting on that cape. Where the heck did he pull out this flashlight from? He's just randomly walking around with a flashlight? And what was this supposed to be? Like, they don't have no cell phones or nothing? Did you scream? Don't touch me. He's literally been screaming like that the whole time. So you mean to tell me the abominable snowman can read? He's seen it said ice skating and he went in there because it said ice and it's cold. That's okay, I guess. Hannah, what is happening? How did that thing just pop out of the fridge? What's in here? We should get a gun. Do you not see her standing there like a Power Ranger about to morph? Why are y'all not asking her questions? Is that a Skittle? What is that? It's candy. Why is it falling from the sky? Look out! Oh, snap! They got vending machines falling from the sky? Where did he get that vending machine from? Was it in the attic? I thought this was like that scene in Kaz Kazam, Kazoo. What's that movie where Shaq was the genie? I forgot what that joke was called. But you remember when a kid whispered burgers and candy to fly from the sky? That's what it reminded me of. Some of y'all probably never even seen that movie. I just showed my age. I know it. Over here! Good idea. Why didn't he just drive it to them? <laughs> like, I don't understand. That joker moves so slow. Get out of there. Get out. Do those things really move that slow? I've never been like ice skating. Have y'all been ice skating? I'm missing out. This winter, I'm going ice skating. I might vlog it, we'll see, but I'm gonna go ice skating. Actually, I take that back. I did go twice maybe, but that was like when I was a little children. That was a long time ago. Yo, some of y'all nails look just like his nails. I need y'all to go clean y'all nails. You see, mine are clean. Y'all need to go clean y'all nails. That means wash your hands. That's what that means. You're nasty. Also, drink water. Hit that thumbs up button too. Drop a comment for the algorithm because I do need the love and the support. I appreciate y'all. Y'all yes. was about to say, he ain't dead. Get the book. Put him in the book. Oh, is that going to be her daddy? It must be her dad because he's the only one. Yo, this kind of reminds me of Scooby-Doo. I think like the second one, which by the way, I did a movie commentary to that like three years ago. Watch that if you haven't. <laughs> this is a pretty cool concept though. I really like it. You had to pick a abominable snowman of Pasadena. You couldn't have picked Little Shop of Hamsters. <laughs> Little Shop of Hamsters is hilarious. <laughs> R.L. who? I don't Yeah, he is R.L. Stein. I figured that because he has the original writings. Well, just as well, because his books suck. Oh, wait, don't, don't, you are brave. You see the endings coming from a mile away. It's like, stop trying to be Stephen King, man. Oh, no. Steve King wishes he could write like me, and I've sold way more books than him, but nobody ever talks about that. Okay. I wonder, is there, is that, is there some truth to that? Did R.L.? I'm, I'm sure Stephen King probably didn't sell as much as R.L. Stein, because R.L. Stein gets rotation in every school district in the world, right? You know what's funny though is till this day I still don't even know what R.L. Stein looks like. No clue. Photo real quick for my Instagram. Oh, is that all? Let me see. Oh yeah, here you go. Thank you. Throw it out the window. Yep, that's what I would do. Dad, wait. There's no time. Start packing. We're moving again. I wonder, do they move every single time that happens? That must be what it is. <laughs> Yo, this dude couldn't hit. I don't know. My mind isn't working, so I have nothing for you. I'm sorry. I failed you. He just couldn't hit. So I created my own friends, monsters, demons, ghouls to terrorize my neighborhood and all the kids that made fun of me. Yeah, that's because you put some type of witchcraft spell on it or something. My monsters literally leapt off the page. He was using some type of special pen or something. Oh no, not him. Hello, Papa. Oh, that's not my boy. Tell me it ain't my Slappy. How long it be? This dude is an OG in the game. Slappy, it's 
So nice to see you again. Did you miss me? They could really turn Slappy into like a horror R-rated movie if they wanted to. Like he's that kind of character. You must have brought me out for something fun. I wonder, is Jack Black playing Slappy too? Because this sounds like his na his voice. You giving me, oh, what's the word? Goosebumps. I like the word play. I like it. I like it. You're trying to put me back in? Bro should have moved a whole lot faster. You've made Slappy very unhappy. Slappy is more scarier than Annabelle. I just want y'all to know. I wonder if Slappy is Annabelle's daddy. What a concept, huh? The fact that this man is about to roll out in a caddy. Yeah, Slappy go hard in the paint, bro. He lit his book on fire and the other one. Then said that's a real page turner. That's hard. Like, that is so hard. Maybe they're friendly. <laughs> Definitely not friendly. <laughs> Yo, the gnomes didn't come to play with y'all. Honestly though, if it was me, I would be just kicking them left and right. Boom, 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 boom. I would not be scared of no little gnomes. I'll save you. I already, yeah, I already knew that wasn't gonna go well. That man hit him with the frying pan like that girl off Tangled. I love how they're using household appliances. Man's is really using a Swiffer right now. This is good little uh, marketing, I guess. Wait, they can put themselves back together? That's gangster. That is so gangster. I guess they could keep coming back to life until they get put in the book. Why did it have to be bear traps? All right, come on, hurry, come on. Oh, imagine getting stuck in a bear trap. Woo, that level of pain. Why couldn't you have written stories about rainbows and unicorns? Because that doesn't sell 400 million copies. 400 Whoa. million? No, Dang. worldwide, it's still very impressive, but shut up. Yeah, R.L. Stein's numbers is wild. 400 milli? He's him. Yeah. I want to know why is it taking so long to get Goosebumps content? That's what I want to know. Why isn't there more shows and movies? Can I get answers, please? Who owns Goosebumps? Y'all need to get on this. Sorry, folks. I slow down, but I can't reach the brake. <laughs> <laughs> How are you reaching the pedal? That's what I want to know. Check out my new bestseller. It'll grow on you. <laughs> I like his one-liners. I like it a lot. Drop calls are going to be the least of this town's... Slappy looks like that one actor. I can't think what his name is. I think it's like Bill Rader or Ader or it's Bill, it's Bill something like that. He was in the Power Ranger movie. I, I just can't remember who he was exactly. Hopefully y'all know who I'm talking about. If you know what I'm talking about, put his name in the comment section or the uh, live chat. Also, spam some hearts in the chat just so I can see that y'all here, you know? I do appreciate y'all, I really do. Oh, I can't believe you don't know that movie. Come over to my house. I got it on Laserdisc. Whoa. Nah, I don't think y'all should be fratting, fratting, fratting. <sighs> There's certain words that just refuse to come out of my mouth. Like, I swear to y'all, I know this word. Fratern fraternizing after hours. Forget it. Just stay in school, bro. I can't stress that enough. I'm gonna drink water. That's what I'm gonna do. Oh, hello, cutie. You must be lost. Well, let's get you some water. We'll take you around the neighborhood. Yo, that dog looks like it's ready to fight. Thinking about leaving his wife and needs a push? Thinking about leaving his wife and needs a... Ma'am, you are way too desperate. And that dog just levitated just now. Okay, you must be so thirsty. Man, if you don't get that damn exorcist dog away from me. Oh! That was creepy. Oh my god, Dad! Dad, what happened to you? Oh, guys, false alarm. It's not my dad. <laughs> what? <laughs> Why did he do all that? That's not his daddy. You just do that. Do you have any idea how many stories I'd have to write to capture every monster I've ever created? Luckily for you, there's AI now, so you don't even have to really do that anymore. It's not just me. That typewriter is special. Yeah, see, it got something on it. Where's the typewriter? Oh, don't worry. It's somewhere safe. Watch Slappy got it. Hold up. Whoa, whoa, whoa. They jamming at their party. Hold up. You talking about nobody can be turned around? That's kind of hard when you're playing that music. I don't know. Somebody gonna get flipped, dipped, and tricked with me. I ain't gonna hold you. This was working earlier. What kind of cell phone does she got? I'm oh, sorry, I was just, I didn't mean to scare you. I mean, I did mean to scare you, but in a, in a playful. Bro got that creepy wrist. Yeah, that's what he got. He's cutting us off, isolating us. I love how Jack Black has been talking like Batman. Is this really how RL sounds like? <laughs> oh, 
He pimp slapping too? The invisible boy is a bully. I'm assuming it's because he's been ignored his whole life. So this is like his revenge. Why is there a sunroof on that ugly car? It's amazing how when stuff like this happens, there's never anybody on the street to just accidentally get killed. I always find that rather interesting. Would love to see like, you know, people minding their business and oh my gosh, a big animal, boom, dead, you know, something. Make it just a little realistic. Maybe see people falling out the building as they're crashing into it. I don't know. Oh no, my Wagoneer. <laughs> Wagoneer? Sneaking off in the middle of the night with strange boys. Unbelievable. Shut it. I mean, he is dressed like a PTA dad, so I, I guess I understand. I'm parched. Let's just take one. I'm sure they'll understand. <laughs> Strawberry. Good God, man. Here. Orange. Yeah, I am not a flavored soda drinker. I'm not even a soda drinker, to be honest with you. Do y'all drink soda? Let me know in the comment section when you should be drinking water. But I know that y'all be drinking it, so tell me what y'all be drinking. Okay, was this Wolf playing basketball? Why does he have on basketball shorts? See, if he would have drunk water, wouldn't have happened. Non-existent problem, right? Werewolf of fever swamp, he can smell my scent. What? <laughs> Spraying it in the air and walking into it does nothing, just for the record. Uh, oh no! Mm -mm. That would have me singing like a canary boy. I'd be. Oh, 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 oh. Mm -mm. Come on, come on. Oh, ah, ah, ah. He's on our tail. Yeah, I don't think y'all gonna outrun the werewolf though. Just get them. I said, get me out of here. Oh, 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 oh. I said, get me out. I tell you what, that kid is better than me because I would have flipped him over. I'm not gonna lie, the graphics on this is really good because that, that looked creepy. Wait, who was that? Oh, it's his auntie. Who is that? It's my Aunt Lorraine. But how does she know where you were at? What are you doing here? This is the back of my store. I didn't know where else to go. I can't get a hold of your mother. Oh, I was just looking at that parking spot too. I didn't even put two and two together. Hi, hello. Hi. Oh no, not RL about to get with your auntie. RL Stein, we owe you a great debt of gratitude. Your reckless driving saved our lives. Oh, she a free. Speaking of reckless, hey, y'all make sure y'all go subscribe to the Reckless 3 podcast. Link in the description. You okay? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, just a root. Nothing. That boy tripped on nothing. Name Champ. It's, it's not a nickname. Wait, that's... Wait, your first name is Champ? Um, my full name is Champion. <laughs> your actual name. His name is Champion? Okay. My mom, she was an all-American sprinter. Two-time world debate champion. Dang, so you come from parents that are winners and you are a loser. Hm. That's why they named you Champ. Please, you're the scary cat. <laughs> Oh! Whoa! It's okay. It's just a statue. All right, you're fine. Why is there so many jump scares in this movie? My hero. Uh-uh. Look at her smiling. Not that funny looking boy. She in love. Ooh. They having a real moment. Wait a minute. She's not real? Did he write her too? Why does this look straight out of Twilight? Like, are you I got PTSD from this movie, bro. Quick, 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 quick. Oh, I had a feeling he wasn't gonna fit through there. I just knew it. Go on without me, save yourself. Okay, good luck. No, I didn't mean a champion! <laughs> champion said I'm gone. He did the race. You can do this. Okay. Oh my nope. goodness, girl, come on. Come on. He's with R.L. Stein. They think they know how to stop all this. Hello? There's no power, baby girl. You can't see that? Yeah, you. Sergeant Slappy. Oh, he looks so hard. I think I want to be Slappy for Halloween. I think, I think it's hard. Who y'all dressing up for Halloween? Who do y'all think I should dress up for for Halloween? She thinks she's a person, okay? Not, not just some figment of your imagination. How could, how could you lie to her? I was trying to protect her. How do you protect 
an imagination. I wrote her in such a way that she thinks she's real, and she is real to me, Zach. Yeah, but she's not, though, and she probably shouldn't know understand. that. Actually, I do. He's like, can you write my daddy back? Because I've been missing him. He's been dead for a long time. I suppose I stopped connecting with real people when I was your age. Dang, he stopped a very long time ago. See, now we're getting into some mental health issues here. Some things he ain't talked about. Slappy's going to come for me. I have a deadline. Literally. Now go! I like that line also. That was a good line. I don't want this day to end. And it doesn't have to, as long as we get rid of Stein. Yo, did he get a new car? That man went to pimp my ride? Did y'all see his new caddy? That joker was clean. Man, I hate the sound of like flies and bees. Like that freaking buzzing noise in my ear irritates me. I'm not gonna lie though, after watching this, it kind of makes me want to go back and watch the Goosebumps TV show. Yep, I knew he was gonna leave her. I knew it, I saw it coming. Uh-oh, here's my boy's time to shine. Come on, champ, step up, put your cape on. Here I come to save the day. Look, yep, he jumped on his back, yeah. He bit the werewolf? That's insane. So does he turn into one out? Like, he got some of the werewolf blood in his mouth, right? You saved my life, champ. Actually, champ. Wait, you gonna kiss him after you just seen him tongue down the werewolf? For real? Girl, you are nasty. The praying mantis. The haunted mask. I love how Slappy is just sitting in the audience. <laughs> that's so gangster. Oh, that's so gangster. I created you. Or is it the other way around? I was about to say, there's no way you created him. Similar. So Slappy is supposed to be like the evil version of R.L. Stein. No! My dumb dummy broke my fingers. I was almost- Also, now he can't write anymore. I ain't gonna lie, seeing those plants make me feel like I should call her. Just saying. She's a- Yes, and I don't care. <laughs> it's like, I love her anyways. That clown is super creepy. It's my fault, not this town's, not yours. That's kind of deep. I wonder if there's any truth to this stuff. Like if RL was actually upset with the real world. I believe in you. Shut up, I'm sorry. <laughs> I mean, shut up. <laughs> Why is everybody so tough on chat, man? Get, cut the kids some slack, just a little bit. You know, we haven't seen his parents the whole movie. I don't even think they exist at this point. Whoa, like from that little angle when they were coming in, they all three of them looked like the same person at first. Oh yeah, good play, good play. But you can't kill them though, cause the only way that they'll go away is by going into the book. We're gonna get through this. Not a good time. Okay. Come on, dude. Like, are you serious? While you was back there hiding, you should be out there, being a man, supposedly. There was one place to hide that was, in fact, the fun house. Man, if it was me and I had to remember it, the book wouldn't get written. I would forget it as soon as he said it. I would come up with my own story. Actually, you know what I would have did? I would have rewrote a lot of that, you know? I would have made sure that we got the happy ending, but I would have been like, an RL sign decided to donate $250 million to my bank account with no questions asked. That's how I would have ended the story. Friend, and you turned your back on me. That's the reason why Slappy's gonna always know where he's at because they are the same person. And you never used it. You're not real, Slappy. Oh, that's hard. I can write you. I like that. I've been saving this monster just for you. Does Slappy write his own book? <laughs> oh, never mind. It's the problem that ain't everyone. Don't let it touch you. Okay, so this is like the personification of when I was a little children we used to play hot monster, lava monster. Lava monster, that's what it is. This is this is what it would look like if it was real. You're trapped. That's what it felt like to be locked inside your books. Oh, I like the analogy. That was super deep. Oh, they're coming. What are we going to do? Finish it, Zach. One by one. 
Do you know the mistakes that I would make under that kind of pressure, especially on a typewriter? I mess up on a regular keyboard where I can just backspace. You can't just backspace on a typewriter. All the monsters. What, wait, what are you waiting for? Come on, open the book. Hannah, there's something that See, it just hit him because he knows that once he opens it up, she's gonna go in there with him. I'll be stuck on a shelf someplace forever. You know? How many sweet 16s can one girl have? She says she ain't dumb. No, open the book, scaredy cat. I'm like, say less, girl. <laughs> Can't say yet, or uh, that ain't 16. Is it 15? I don't know. Maybe if I hold on to you tight enough. You have to let go, Zach. That man is really like holding her. Bro, let her go. You're making this more painful than it needs to be. Lappy's <laughs> not happy. Oh, yeah, he gonna remember that. I'm just sad we never got to share a dance. How the heck is he kissing? Okay. I don't know about that. I don't know about that. And they was kissing like two stale chips. Like, I don't know. Welcome back to class, guys. All right, welcome back. Do you know, I would throw out the PTSD line for so long that my parents would have to homeschool me. I don't want to go back to school. I'm terrified. We just got like harassed and our lives was threatened the whole dance. I'm scared. I don't want to go back to school. That would be my way of trying to tell them like, I, I'm not gonna, I don't want to continue. Like, uh, I don't want to. Okay, you breathing? You're gonna be great, okay? Wait, did he become a teacher? My God, what is that? I rub myself in cilantro every morning. Oh, uh, what? He smelled like cilantro. There it is. I don't know about that. Oh, oh went too far. I like her little goofy self. I like that. I don't know why, but I like it. I wouldn't do it, but I like it. And the twist. Hello, Mr. Stein. Hello, Mr. Black. Okay, so that must be the real R.L. Stein. That, that must have been him. I don't know what he looks like, but that was significant in some kind of way. And in here. And also right over there. Did he turn her into a real girl? No, he didn't. No, he didn't. You owe me a dance. Wow, she looks so vibrant. Oh, he burnt the book! He got the daddy approval, so he's good. He's in there. Wait, what? Was that the typewriter? Oh, the invisible boy is still out? Oh, snap. He forgot about me. That's a great way to end it. Oh, that was good. I freaking love this movie. Wow, that was so good. So that was Goosebumps. Like I said already, I freaking loved it. Now I did see that there is a second one. So y'all already know that we're gonna be doing that very soon, very quickly. I'm, I might even just go get something to eat, take me a shower, and I might film part two right now, but y'all might not see it for another week or two, or maybe even a month. Who knows what my schedule, right? Ain't no telling, but it's for sure coming. I don't know if I'm gonna watch it today, or I'm gonna wait and do it another day. But regardless, it's coming for sure. But if you guys enjoyed this movie, comment, share, give this video a thumbs up, comment down below, and we're gonna see what we do next with the hashtag Bingers, B-I-N-G-E-R-S, and I'll get to it as soon as possible. Shout out to everybody that watched this premiere, spam with some hearts in the chat. I still hope that you guys are doing, looking, and smelling amazing. I really do, and also I hope that you guys are staying hydrated. Y'all let me know, out of the Goosebumps series, like the books or the TV show, what was your favorite episode, or what was your favorite R.L. Stein Goosebumps book? Let me know. I wanna, I think I, I think I am gonna go back and watch a couple episodes. I don't know if I'm gonna film it for the channel. Maybe, if, depending on, you know, how this video does and your guys' response, if you guys think that I should do at least like a couple episodes, just for nostalgia reasons. I'm not gonna go through like the whole series. I might do something like that, but I don't know. But for sure, I'm gonna watch it for my own leisure because I love Goosebumps, like I really do. But anyways, I appreciate y'all love and support. That'll do it until my next movie commentary. I will see y'all then. Billy Binge is out. Ooh.